learns helpful hints. This segment is about a powerful tool that you have at your disposal, your sticker chart. I've got some logistical recommendations on how to make this work smoothly for you. First of all, the basic premise is, once a child fills up the whole entire row, they get to go to the treasure basket. Talk up that treasure basket. It doesn't even really matter what you have in it. If you make a big deal out of it, they will love it. They will want to go to it. This probably cost me 10 cents, and a child is going to love to get it because they went to the treasure basket. How exciting for them. On a logistical level, when it comes to your sticker chart, put your names in alphabetical order to make it easy when you want to single out a student for a good behavior. Make sure you use permanent marker, which, by the way, will come off at the end of the year with hairspray. Your stickers. I recommend high-quality stickers. Put it up in a place that's easy for you to get to, but the child cannot. Buy high-quality stickers, too, because once a child go, goes all the way, fills up their whole row, and goes to the treasure basket, you're going to have to be the one that takes it off, and the higher-quality stickers are easy to take off. Another thing I recommend about the stickers is to change it up periodically. That way you can see which children it is that you've, you, that you've given a lot of stickers to recently and which ones you might, have, might need a little bit more attention. How to use the sticker chart. At the beginning of the year, I use it a whole lot to shape behavior. And then once the year gets going and people get in the routine, not so much. I might go two or three days without using it at all. Or I might use it a whole bunch on one day. They don't know. They don't know when they're going to get a sticker. But whenever they do get a sticker, I'm very clear as to why it is that they are earning that sticker. Very specific. An example of how I would give a sticker, especially at the beginning of the year when I'm establishing routines and giving out a lot of stickers, would be with their agenda. The expectation is that, that the child take the agenda home every day and that they bring it home signed and bring it back to school sign. So what I'll do is have all the agendas opened up for the day. Oh, Erin, your mommy signed this. You remember to bring this back to school. You burned a sticker. Oh, Ashley, I see your mommy's name on this. You remember to bring it back to school. Way to go. Way to be responsible. You burned a sticker. The first two to three weeks, there are a lot of stickers given out for pretty much every single thing in the, the routine that I expect for these children to do. In short, oh, this is a wonderful tool that you have at your fingertips. Use it wisely, make it sturdy, make it easy for you, and enjoy.